Once we have the equipment dimensions entered in, we can start with getting the guidance page set up, which is going to be started by hitting the main menu button and then the GS2 button on the side. The GS2 menu, we're going to click on resources and fill in the critical information of the client, farm, field, and task. Once we click on the client, we can see a drop down where you can either select a client that's been pre established. Or if you hit the new, you can enter it in using the keypad. We also follow the same suit for the farm and field to get that information entered. We can then go on to the task and select the, the specific task that we are completing, whether it be planting or harvesting, etc. The next step is hitting the guidance tab and then the guidance settings. We're going to select the guidance mode that we want to, whether it be a straight track, adaptive curve, depending upon field conditions and desire. Next we're going to hit the view tab in the upper left hand corner and then set track zero in the lower left hand corner. We're going to want to make sure we have a name for the track which we can either select from the drop down menu or by hitting the new button and entering a new one in. The method we are going to suggest using is an A plus B heading where we select an A point at the start of a pass and then at the end of the pass you hit set B and it will snap a straight line in between those two points and then mirror that for the rest of the field. After setting point B we can hit accept which will bring us back under the view page again where we can see now that the guidance lines are laid out across the field. We can also notice that on the bottom portion of the screen, the pie graph now has two pieces filled in. To get the third piece filled in, we just simply press the icon with the steering wheel. And then the fourth piece will fill in once we hit the Auto Track Engage button on the tractor. When the pie chart turns green, Auto Track is engaged and the tractor is now actively steering.